Hi, I'm Ken with Basement Waterproofing Specialist, and today we're going to be talking about foundation repair. One thing we're going to specialize in right now is poured concrete walls. Traditionally, with poured concrete walls, you'll see a crack that goes down the wall, and most of the time, general contractors, waterproofing contractors, will fill the crack in with some type of epoxy. They'll either drill holes every six to eight inches, squirt the epoxy in the wall, and or they'll fill the crack in. And in rare cases, they'll take a strap called a carbon fiber strap and glue it across the crack. The epoxy will actually stop the water for a period of time, but when you get expansion and contraction with temperatures and changes, the crack has a tendency to separate and that'll tear the coatings. At the same time, from a structural point of view, that does not address the structural repair. Even your carbon fiber strap, which is pretty strong, has a tendency not to rip, but the adhesive that's applied to the carbon fiber will strip off the wall and you'll have a wall that separates. One of the big concerns with a poured concrete wall crack, it might stay dormant for years or the crack might continue and go down into the footer. The footer is, is the framework of what holds the concrete wall in place. Now most of the time that's not happening, but there is a possibility that it does. What we do is we guarantee for the life of the structure of your home that that wall will not move. What we'll try to do is dig the outside of the house up and we take a 304 stainless plate. This has a 90,000 pound tensile strength and on the outside of the wall, after we fill the crack in and we seal it, we'll then use six inch bolts and bolt it into the wall and we'll epoxy the plate on the outside. Most importantly, this plate prevents the foundation from separating and prevents the footer from potentially cracking. While we're on the outside, what we also do is dig down to the footer and we'll underpin the footer while we're there just as a secondary precaution. There are times when we can't do this procedure on the outside because there might be patios and decks. And then what we would do is we would take the stainless steel plates and put them on the inside. As I said, 90,000 pound tensile strength, that wall's not moving anywhere, and that's the proper way to fix a poured concrete wall. If this was my family's house, that's what they get and no less. For this and any other waterproofing, water management, mold remediation, or structural repairs, please call Basement Waterproofing Specialists. We'll be there for you.